could take a toll on the travel industry. Some travel agents are getting calls from customers and they're bracing for cancellations. News Channel 3's Tracy Lair joins us live from Santa Barbara tonight. And Tracy, travelers may see some deep discounts soon. They just might, CJ. You know, like Santa Barbara, Paris is such a huge tourist destination, but people are having second thoughts about going, yet some people are looking for those discounts. The Eiffel Tower, draped in the colors of the French flag, is open again following Friday's terror attacks. But will tourists come? The owner of Strictly Vacations in Santa Barbara just got his first European vacation cancellation via email. The world is getting too complicated and travel more unpredictable. While no one can predict what the future holds as far as world politics and, ple and pleasure travel are concerned, Lori and I are very uncomfortable planning future trips to Europe at this time. And so they are canceling their trip to Europe, but they're moving it over to Tahiti. After 9-11, the agency saw a million dollars worth of cancellations. Agents don't think they'll see anything like that due to increased security measures in place. I've always said it's the best time to go because there are going to be less people that are going to be traveling. And just give yourself the extra time. There's nothing more upsetting than missing a flight because you had to go through security or extra levels of security. Some passengers flying in and out of the Santa Barbara airport said they would stick to domestic flights. Others say they wouldn't hesitate to visit the City of Light. Well, if I had the chance to go to Paris, I certainly would go. I'm not one who's easily put off by these kinds of uh, crazy events. And I know that uh, they're sporadic and they're random, but we can't give up living. You can't give up doing what you're doing because you almost play into the hands of the people who are trying to uh, scare you in a sense. That's what agents hope to hear. Show the world that we're strong, that we're not going to be fearful and we're going to want to stay home. Now, we did see some package deals already online tonight, and we ran into someone walking on State Street who said he was already scheduled to go in a couple of weeks, and he couldn't wait. In Santa Barbara, Tracy Lair, News Channel 3. Okay, thanks.